Hey everyone, Clay Plays Games here, and today I am playing Stardew Valley. If you don't know what Stardew Valley is, it is essentially a RPG-based game where your character has inherited a farm uh, from your grandfather, and you get to you know grow crops, raise animals, go to the town, sell your your crops, your stuff, and just kind of have yourself a good old time all around. And it has some, I want to say, realistic aspects to it, but almost like the way you have to grow the food honestly takes several days to actually get done. It's very interesting, but I wanted to play for a little bit, see how it goes, because it's been a while since I last played this. So I wanted to see if I could kind of get back into the swing of things. So hopefully you all enjoyed this video. If you all do and want to see more Stardew Valley, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to share us with your friends, share us with your family, share us with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on so you never miss any of my videos when they go up. Also, if you feel like becoming a member and want to see these videos early, y'all go check out the join button on my channel or check out the link down in the description below. So let's get into it. I see a package right here at the front area. I got some parsnip seeds. 50 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Oh, thanks. I guess I'm... I guess the mayor knows me? I... Okay, and that's interesting. Use tool menu. I don't remember there being a tutorial on how to play this. Let's see. How do I swap over? Okay, so it's with the R2 and L2 buttons. Got it. And as you see, like, you can't get through most of this area without uh, breaking most of it. And essentially, you just have to go through all this. You don't have to clear it up if you don't want to. But if you want to have this entire area, like completely empty so you can build your own farm. That's kind of the best way to go about it. <laughs> I'm probably using the axe for the wrong thing, in all honesty. Do I... I don't think it has damage on it. I don't think it's going to take damage, but I do notice on the very bottom right that it takes stamina, and that's a whole other thing with this game. Let me... Like, you get to do so much during the day, and then you get tired immediately. So you kind of have to be careful how you spend your time. And honestly, I'm going to like clear up this area right here on the front right side and try and set up my own little farm to get the parsnip seeds started. Because honestly, that would be a good idea to get everything out of the way and handled first. And then that way, in the next couple of days, I can start actually growing these more and selling these to people. Because that's kind of the, a big thing for this. Honestly, this is pretty cool. It's relaxing. That's another thing. This game is very relaxing. You can just take your time, spend however much like you want on it. Uh, kind of grow whatever you feel like. Let me get these out of the way. I see a frog. I don't know if I can go after it. Uh, I've got 500... I'm guessing that's gold. i got 500 gold. Let's see. Is there an inventory button get, getting started? Oh! Okay. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed packet on the till soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Got it. Okay, that's nice. Oh, I gotta go greet people? Are you kidding? It would be nice. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Okay, I'm gonna have to do that at some point. I'm gonna have to go meet people. I can't just stay here by myself doing nothing. But I want to at least get at least a lot of this handled, I think. From the looks of it, there's a lot to go through. I have to... See, I even have to... That's another thing. I can't just walk across it. I actually have to break through a lot of this and spend energy on it. I never like just wasting pure energy. Now, if the sound does sound a little weird, it's because I don't have the sounds on, like the music. Uh, I don't want to get any kind of copyright strike on the, on this video. Uh, but I've got all the ambient stuff turned up. I've got the footsteps as loud as it will go. Everything else is up, just the music is down. So I think I think I'm in a good spot to go ahead and get this started. If this will there we go. Wait, what was that? Oh, I know what that is. That's supposed to got it. Okay. So if I want to start my farm, I'm trying to think of where I want to get it started. Cause I wanna make like an actual Let's just, let's just go with this for now. Three, four, five. And we could do like, maybe, yeah, that's the stuff. So what I'm gonna do is uh, three rows of the parsnip seeds. 
since there's 15 total. If I can just hit it in the right spot, please. Thank you. And then all I gotta do is... I think place them. That's ah, a wrap. Okay. And see, it gets very simple after a while. You just kind of gotta get into the motion of it. Figure it out for yourself sometimes. But once I get all of this planted, I'm going to... Uh, grab some water, which I need. What am I doing with this? Oh, I got clay. I don't remember there being clay in this game. Interesting. Turns out I'm in the game, everyone. Okay. And thankfully I already had... Well, that's a little too much water. I'm just kind of pouring out the whole bucket here. I don't know what else to expect. I'm going to pour everything out here, refill my water. Days, I won't say entirely up, but the time does go fast. I'm looking at... Does it go 30 minutes? No, I'm trying to remember how long it goes. I haven't been really paying attention much. It goes by every 10 minutes, but I don't know exactly how long every 10 minutes in-game is. So, we just go until it gets nighttime, pretty much. Um, I'd say maybe around we stop at like 6 or 7. I don't know, just to save stamina, because if you, if you can tell, it's already close to being completely emptied. Um, let's see, what is the crate for? This is... Uh, well, I didn't mean to... Oh... What I, this probably isn't... Oh, I think I remember what you do with this. I think you use this and you... This is how you sell stuff without actually having to go into town. That is another way you can do this. Um, I think just probably to get some quick, easy money. Uh, if I'm right, I should just be able to... I'm going to sell all that because I can get that at any time. So that's all going up. I've got plenty of stamina to go into the town. So while I'm mad, I'm just gonna take a quick look. Is there a way? I don't know what I just. What am I? What did I press? There we go. I don't know what I pressed. I did something where I now have an a, a mouse cursor on my screen. Neat. Okay. As you can see, this is the the town area. I think this is a quest board, if I'm not mistaken. Okay. So this tells you like the days of the week and like what time of the year it is. Uh, okay, there's some events happening in like two weeks, but I guess we got a lot of birthdays coming up, flower dance, egg festival, another birthday bookseller. So it probably would be best to start like visiting people over time. That would probably be a, a good idea. So let me see. There's a saloon. Oh, that's right. I do need to start greeting people. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. All right, sounds good. I'm going to try and greet as many people as I can. Hello, you must be Clay. I'm... Oh, you must be Clay, the new farmer. I thought she was the new farmer for a second. I'm Caroline. I was about to say, how many new farmers do we got here? Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. Evelyn. You can call me Granny if you like. Ah, you know what? That's probably better than calling you Evelyn every time. That's a lot easier to remember. Who are you? Oh. Aren't you the one who just moved in? I am. I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Well, you've met me. I'm here. I just heard a door slam. Uh, who are you? Okay, you're Penny. Oh, hello. I'm Penny. Uh, yeah, well, that, that makes a, a lot of sense. Uh, what's over here? It's been so long since I've last actually gone through most of this, so, like, having to look. Our beloved M M Mona? Oh, I, see. I understand. I'm sorry. I don't understand a single word of that. If someone else knows what that means, let me know in the comments, but I have no clue what that means. Okay. Wait, hold on. Are you... You're the, you're the mayor. So that was your first night in the old cottage. Pretty nice. I can't argue. It was actually fairly decent. I slept like a bug on a rug. Alright. So, I greeted a couple of people. Uh, I think... I mean, let me do one more. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. How you doing, Sam? I think this is a shop, if I'm not wrong. Okay, but no one's here. But there's a backpack for sale. Which I can't afford. Uh, that just upgrades stuff. Got it. Alright. Are you... Okay, you're, you're Pierre. 
Hey, it's Clay, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll always buy produce from you for a good price. Okay. Can you get behind the counter so I can probably buy some more seeds? No? Okay. That's fine. It's getting 530. I'm almost out of stamina. So what I'm going to do is probably farm a little bit more. Just kind of use up all the stamina while it's available. And what I'm going to do from there is simply... Uh, just like I'll just rest once I'm done, and but this way I can clear up a lot more uh, of these areas ahead of time, especially like these, like these empty grass areas because you, th you never know what's hiding in them. And I gotta say, I think these are the quickest like things to clear up, uh, and, and then above that is probably the, the, the sticks on the ground. Oh, wait, well, hold on, can I fill that up with water? It looks like a, a... Okay, I totally can. Awesome. So if I ever have an animal pet or something like that, I will have at least a water bowl already full. It, you do have to spam square, though. I am playing on a PlayStation, uh, and you have to spam square for the trees. Like, you just have to constantly press it and press it. Uh, can you hold it? Okay, you can hold it. So that probably would be easier. All right. See, it's getting late. Is there anything in the mail? I don't have any mail. Good to know. Now, this is, game is also a crafting game as well. You just have to, like, slowly start earning stuff. What if I... I'm going to quickly sell more items. I'm just going to quickly do this. Is it... Oh, uh, you just have to press X for that. Got it. Um... I'm probably not going to get a lot for this. People are probably uh, going to think I'm crazy for trying to sell basic items, but hey, it might work out. Go to sleep for the night? Yes, please. Let me go ahead and refill the stamina. Okay, and see, at the end of the day, after you sleep, you get to see what you've made from everything you sold. So, we made nothing from farming, but for foraging, we got 54 gold. Mining, I guess, because we got coal, 15 others so probably like rocks yeah rocks and wood and everything else 171 gold so not not bad i can just farm the basic stuff and get a good amount of gold for it so day two of spring year one I'm, I'm sorry but whose chicken is that because i don't have a chicken on my farm so who whose whose farm has a chicken that just crows that loud i do have mail advertisement I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Well, I don't have enough for that. Do I have more mail? Oh, hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. I've got something for you. No, for you. Well, that's a that's a YA uh, from Willie. Captain Willie. You better, better not mess around with Captain Willie. Okay, and as you can see, my uh, my parsnip seeds have grown a little bit more. I believe parsnips take four days. So, this with this being day two, uh, we're about halfway, I think. Or, it's I think it's on day five you can harvest them, if I remember correctly. It's either on day four or day five that you start harvesting. But, as you see, I have only these types of plants to work with. So... But this is a lot of fun. I'm actually kind of excited to keep playing this. Uh, I had it in my like, just kind of game list of things that I could choose from. I'm like, what do I want to play? Like, what sounds fun? And I'm like, well, I always had a good time with this. It's nice and relaxing. You don't have to worry much about anything. It's not, I, to my knowledge, it's not like a game that's supposed to stress you out or you're supposed to complete challenges or anything. You're just supposed to farm for a while and just play out the seasons. I don't know what it's like during the winter. I don't know how you're supposed to truly be a farmer during around that time. So it's all for kind of just figuring out. Can I? Oh, no. I, I pressed R2 by accident. That's why. But let me get some of this. Okay. So as you see, like, I'm just farming more stuff. I'm going to sell this again like late tonight. I'll probably get... I'm hoping to get close to the same amount that I made. Oh, there's a building over on the left. Can I get to that? 
Uh, what do I need? Let me let me just start breaking through the trees because that'll clear up more room for the place. Then I can start working in different areas. Uh, but Pierre will have a lot of like the seeds that I need. So if you're ever wondering where to get those, Pierre will have them. Um, as well as you can fish. And if I can get, do I have a need for a fishing rod? Oh, I picked up a. What I pick up? I found a geode. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside? So that's what you can get from from mining. So always remember to get that. Oh, that's why I need the backpack. That makes a lot of sense. Got it. Okay. So where's? Let's see. I'm guessing these are my skills. I don't have a lot. I can't. I can't even mess with them. Okay. And then these are all of the people, or at least majority of the people. I haven't met a whole lot of them yet. And right here, this is the map. I don't know if this... It doesn't move around, so I don't think it zooms out or anything. I think this is just the entire uh, layout of it. See, and here's here's where you can craft. So, as far as what I can make... Not a whole lot. <laughs> uh, Alright, so we're going to have to wait. We're going to have to like, really wait on... Try to do any kind of crafting. Uh... Because I will like, eventually build like a gate or a fence around my garden or farm. Uh, just to kind of make it look like a decent little farm. I do need to make like more proper rows to go through each one. That way I'm not... Well, actually, I don't think it's a problem to actually walk on the, the plants in this game. I'm thinking of like Minecraft logic... Because if you if you're not careful and you start walking over the plants and like you jump, it gets rid of the entire plant. Okay, so what is this? Whatever this once was, it's now in ruins. Is this something I can repair? If it is, I'd like to repair it at some point. I mean, okay, and I think is this a mine? It's been a while. Okay, I don't know what this. Okay, I, I kind of remember this area. I don't know what is supposed to happen in here. For anyone that does know, let me know in the comments, because I don't think I've ever really gone through that area much, because I never understood what that was for. So if you know what that's for, let me know. Okay, but, you know, kind of clear up that path. Water's still in the bowl, so it's all good. It's only 10.50 in the morning. I'm almost out of stamina. What if I... Let me fill up the water again. And then sell this. Yes, yes, yes. And hold on to that. I'm going to sell the clay and the mixed seeds as well. So we've got that sold. I'm going to head into town. I'm, actually, I'm going to go to the beach. We're going to go ahead and, and uh, head on over to the beach. Because I think, I think I can get my fishing rod from there. And then that way, I can start fishing for fish. Because what else am I going to fish for? Um, but I can start selling fish once I've caught them more and more. Um, and I think you get rewards or something. You, like you're, the more you talk to people over time, and the more it makes some kind of connection with these people. And that's kind of a... I think, that's, I think there's a reward system with that. It's been a long time. Okay. We got ourselves a cutscene, I guess. Ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. I'm probably doing a terrible voice. I do apologize. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. I'm getting more... I, I don't know where I'm going with this. <laughs> finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive, and hey, maybe you'll buy some from the shop once in a while. Actually, that's a pretty decent thing to have. So he's pretty much just kind of lending me his old, his old bamboo pole, which sounds wrong, but I, I guarantee you it's not. So I suppose with that, there's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. Okay. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say, anyway. Okay. So, I'm, try I'm trying to remember how I'm supposed to fish. I just imagine I use this, like the uh, 
the item on it. So, let me grab the fishing rod. Oh, hold that. Got it. Okay. How do I... How do I... What am I supposed to press? What do I press? I don't remember what to press when I catch a fish. Okay. Okay, so it's just square the entire time. It's square the entire time. Got it. I, I press X. And then you have to keep... Okay, that's right. You have to keep the fish in the... Oh, you have to hold square. Like, you have to really... Oh, I forgot how hard fishing was. I got myself a one-inch anchovy. Man, that... The little fish put up a fight. Hold on, I want to try and catch another one. This time I'm more well-prepared. Come on, I know you're biting. I know you're waiting. Come on, just, just a nibble. Just a little nibble. Okay, here we go. Ah, you tricked me. I thought you were going to start moving. Ah, no. No, I'm smarter than you. Come on now. Watch it be a, okay, I was about to say, watch that be like a two inch anchovy, it just gets one, one, like one inch harder. Uh, it gets one, it gets tougher with, with an extra inch. Uh, but we got ourselves another anchovy. I could sell those, but I'm gonna actually put those up in the, uh, in my little, I guess, junk drawer chest thing back at the, back at the house. Oh, wait a minute. I, I see the little tower statue thing over on the side. I got myself a clam. I could probably sell that too. Anything you find on the ground, you can pretty much sell. Surprisingly, like stuff will sell. I don't know why, but it, it sells. Um, let's see. I got 740. I'm gonna check to see if Piers uh, in his store. Cause if so. Okay, nothing on the. Wait a minute. Oh, help one. I'm looking for someone to bring ten. Bring me six copper ores to aid in the under. Standing of local minerals from Clint. I I can't accept that unfortunately because I don't know how to get copper so Okay, but let's see seeds for sale parsnip mmm What if I did more? <sighs> parsnip would sell it takes four days to mature it says over there on the right. Um, let me Try and get myself back to just 500 so we have ourselves 12. I can make four rows. I guess everyone's having a yoga dance-off going on over on the side. Pretty sweet. I, I don't feel like joining in, but it's cool that they, they're doing that. So, I've got myself some parsnip. I've got uh, some fish. i got a clam. And i got flour. And we've been selling everything else. Is there an auto run? There's not an auto run, from what I can tell. That's fine. I don't really need it. Uh... But we're just gonna go in here. I'm gonna sell the fish, the flour, the clam. I'm gonna hold on to these two things, and all of that will be done by by the end of the night. I'm just gonna wait in the house for a little bit. So that was Stardew Valley. It's a lot of fun, very relaxing. It's a game that I highly recommend that uh, you try out if you haven't played it yet. Uh, I know it's on PlayStation and Xbox, and obviously I think Steam as well. But I don't know if it has any kind of mobile apps or anything. But if you have a way to play it, I highly recommend uh, getting it and playing it for yourself. A lot of fun. And if you want to see me to play more of this, let me know down in the comments below. Make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you haven't already. Make sure to share this with your friends. Share this with your family. Share this with whoever. Make sure notifications are turned on. You never miss any of my videos when they go up. Also, if you feel like becoming a member want to see these videos early, y'all go check out the join button on my channel or check out the link down in the description below, and I will see you on the next one. So, with all that being said, thank you all so much for watching this video, and have a great day.